My name is Vinip Tell, Chief Engineer here at Mahindra Racing and we have a number of engineering functions. We've got race engineers who directly work with the driver and speak to the driver during the race. They work on setup of the car. We've got performance engineers that look after all of the data side of the car, looking at the health and other performance parameters including strategy. And we've got system engineers who are more concerned with all the electronic systems on the car. And it's my job to ensure that they're all working smoothly. And then my other role during the race is to make high level strategy decisions live to try and inform all the engineers of what's going on. In Formula E compared to say Formula One, the driver has actually a lot more control. Formerly we've done a good thing with regulations and our telemetry is quite limited coming back from the car live to the engineers in the pits. We have a very, very regimented military process which is to make sure the driver knows when to give us the information on track and he's obviously concerned with other things that we aren't concerned with which is fighting other cars and drivers and, and keeping the thing going in a straight line really quickly. The areas where the engineering dominates the Formula E race uh, begin a long time before the race. You know, we're, we're here for just a day um, and that really means preparation is everything. So we spend uh, almost 200 hours of man time uh, involved in the, the simulator, which involves the driver um, in the loop simulator. They learn the circuit and that allows us to refine which strategy is optimum going into the race weekend. So if we qualify well and we're near the front, we'll have a strategy. If we're out of position and we're near the middle of the back, we'll have a different strategy. And we're, we're basically able to have all these options available to us, understand all of them in absolute detail before we even arrive at the event. So the most challenging side of planning strategy for Formula E is the fact that a lot of the circuits have been new, even though we're into the second season. So the circuits we go back to are easier than the new circuit. We'll use the learning from last year a hell of a lot. The circuit hasn't changed that much. Uh, we'll see what went right last year for ourselves and all the other teams. So we spend a lot of time crunching the timing data and data that's available for the other strategies. But quite often uh, we arrive at the track and we put in these 200 hours and we realise the track's been built completely differently. So that's a big challenge. You put in all of your prep work but you might end up tearing it up and putting it in the bin and that's really when you don't rely too much on your tools, you don't rely too much on the prep just in case your instinct is telling you something is better than what you've got in front of you. One of the biggest draws for Formula E as an engineer is it, it's been a bit of a sea change in everyone's thinking. It's been learning a new technology. M most of us have not had much electrical vehicle experience before, so you're talking about current instead of fuel, and the way that the system works means the way you think about racing changes. You've got regenerative capabilities uh, with the electric motor, because if it spins backwards, it charges the battery. So this brings a whole new area of expertise and learning for our engineers. We've picked people who have some of that expertise, but we've learned the expertise ourselves. So that constant learning is still happening. The main satisfying element is going racing and doing well. If you have a system in place, uh, as all good teams will, and your system works flawlessly, and it could be almost mundane, but you end up with uh, a really good result for both cars, that's when you know you've done your job really, really well. Nobody's panicked, everything's followed the plan meticulously, and you've had good results because you've, you've executed a well-orchestrated plan.